Well, good morning. It is Thursday, July 18th, early. I actually drove out to the lake. I was planning on fishing today, but then when I got there, I just wasn't feeling it. So I turned around and came back home. Thought I would take a few shots with the old Anita here. I haven't shot this since the last time I shot it on video. So here we go, the first shot in uh, probably what a month. Obviously at the deer. Perfect. A little high, but I'll take it. Finally got batteries for my camera, so I'm gonna be, this weekend, we'll be heading out to the farm. See, look at that, that's perfect, right in the middle of the lungs. A Little bit high, about an inch high for where I aim. I aim for the heart, you know, right there. But, for my first shot, and that's probably high because um, my point on is different with this than it is with the recurves. And I've been shooting the recurves more than I've been shooting this bow. But anyways, I got the cameras for the, uh, well, I mean, I got the batteries for the cameras, so I'll be going out to the farm this weekend to set those up. Now there, <laughs> that is exactly where you want to hit. That would have been a bullseye on any target that I shoot at. And those shots are 23 yards. Oh, that was perfect. Should we step back to 30, 33, 30, give it a try. Tell you what, and this is not a political statement, but I'll be glad when the RNC is done because I live in Milwaukee and that's where the RNC is at and just all of the extra traffic the constant helicopters flying up above is just driving me bonkers geez I can barely see the the deer because of how overgrown everything is I'm not sure how this is gonna go I think a little high Yep, a little bit higher than my very first shot. All right, let's try that again. That would have been a spine shot. No bueno. It's nice and cool today. It's only a oh, it's 55 degrees when I woke up. I think it's warmed up to 60 now. All right, let's try this again. 30 some odd yards. There you go. That's right in there, right in that lower quadrant. 
maybe a hair low, but on a real deer, it would have been a perfect heart shot. That's what I'm talking about. All right. So let's try one at my usual distance while I'm hunting here, 15 yards. What a beautiful morning. I don't know why I didn't feel like fishing. I think, you know, I fished Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. And, you know, I'm kind of old, so my body's a little bit sore from loading and unloading that dang kayak, which is not light. Of course, 15 yards is perfect with this bow. So I think I just needed a break. I'll probably be back on the lake again tomorrow and then Saturday I'm gonna take those cameras out to the farm. Just gonna be kind of a pain because there's gonna be a lot of tall grass. I haven't been back there once this year. So I'm assuming the grass is gonna be tall and the skeeter's gonna be terrible and we'll see. We'll see Saturday morning. Do one more shot at 33. Just cause I like watching the arrow fly. Oh, perfect. <laughs> Tell you what, this bow is tuned so well right now that there is no wiggling of that arrow at all. And with the lighted knocks, I can completely see it. It's just straight. That was another beautiful heart shot right there. Well, actually, it looks like maybe about an eighth of an inch out of their heart. Still a perfect, perfect hunting shot. So it's a glorious day. I haven't missed a sunrise this summer. I'm usually in bed before the sun sets. I'm usually in bed right around 8, 8.30 these days. But I am just enjoying myself through this stage of my life. So hope you guys are enjoying your lives and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thanks, bye. Hunting season right around the corner. Can't wait. All right, bye.